Shalom Akim. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honor to our apostles and elders at Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to the Akim that's doing this work in sincerity and truth. And uh, for this lesson right here, um, I want to hit the comment board. Okay. All right. Um, this is um, from the GMS Pray for a Few Days, New Jersey. Okay. This is our backup channel camp. Okay from um, GMS uh, Soldiers of Faith, New Jersey. Okay, and um, this video was done maybe about two weeks ago. And I wanna hit up uh, um, the comment board on here. Okay, all right. You know, because you got a lot of people, man, that's just coming into the truth, man. And, uh, you know, they don't, they don't have this truth all the way, you know. And um, one particular person here, okay, which goes by the name uh, Proud to be Judah, okay. Now I'm gonna read his comment, and then I want to get into a little bit uh, of this uh, of the situation here. Okay. All right. He says, "Why do you brothers teach that Esau is a devil? Right? If Esau wasn't in the earth until Genesis 25:25, then how is Esau the devil when the devil was thrown out of heaven during the time of Adam and Eve? <laughs> okay. So he's asking a question here, though. But you know." You know, I, I'm perceiving that he's not coming uh, 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 in sincerity. Okay? All right? Because I'm going to read everything that he said, though, because I want to hit his points one by one. But, um, um, you know, I want to probably break these um, these videos up, though, because, um, you know, Jake has a short att attention span, you know? And um, I'll probably break this up in um, different lessons. But um, reading on, and another thing, Esau was never in heaven, nor did he ever have angels, right? The scriptures say that Satan and his angels were cast out of heaven. He's referring to uh, Revelation uh, 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 12, um, 8 and 9, you know, which he has no understanding on that, right? And it says, what scripture says that Esau was ever in heaven, in the, in the heavens, okay? So now, you know, first of all, you know, you got a lot of these simple, simple guys that come up in this truth, man, you know? And the first thing you have to do is you got to keep, you keep that foot. When you enter in the house of the Most High, man, and give uh, or be more ready to hear than to give a sacrifice of fools, man. You know, because if you're just coming into this thing, you know, you gotta humble yourself first, first and foremost, man. You know, and 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 that's how you learn. Okay, you just can't just utter uh, uh, the sacrifice of fools, man. You know, you need to try to get the proper understanding. You know, and and one reason why you don't have the proper understanding is that you're not following a, a great millstone. You know, and I can prove it. You know gonna hit his page okay first of all let's go into the channels that he subscribes to okay all right there's no no gms channels up on this page okay bunch of madness on here all right all right oh he has okay uh 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 shield of faith but uh other than that that's how he links to our our channel okay all right you know all right and this channel is 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 the, is the head brother uh, um from um gms soldiers of faith okay new jersey okay but all this other stuff that he has on here is madness, okay? And then when you look at his videos, okay? Self-explanatory, man. He got GOCC up here, you know, and all types of other madness, okay? You got this guy here talking about uh, the true gospel, okay? With, 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 with long hair, okay? You see? All right? So, you know, you know, you got these guys that come in here, man, and, and you know, you know, it, 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 it's it, it, it's funny because all right he accepts the facts that he's from the tribe of judah okay all right you know that basically he comes out of the line of, of jacob you know but he can't uh, uh grasp the fact that esau is the devil you see so so how do you come up come to that conclusion though you know you know and and one more thing concerning this is that his name is is proud to be judah okay all right, and the, and the scripture says that that pride was not made for man. You know, all right, going in uh, Ecclesiastes the tenth chapter. You know what I'm saying? So this guy has no type of understanding. You know what I'm saying? He's he, he's prideful. Okay, he doesn't know the scriptures. You know, and, and and it's one thing not to know the scriptures though, but you got to humble yourself. Okay, all right. These questions are not put out here in, in sincerity. You see, so. Um, I'm gonna just put a couple of precepts together to uh, uh, um, um, help edify, you know, the body, okay, 
on um, a couple of these these, these uh, questions. So the first one is, if Esau wasn't in the earth until Genesis 25, 25, then how is Esau the devil when the devil was thrown out of heaven during the time of Adam and Eve? All right, so now let's go to let's go to the scriptures. Let's go to let's go to Genesis chapter three, verse one. Now the serpent was more subtile than any beast of the field, which Yahweh power had made, and he said unto the woman, Yea, have have the most high said ye shall not eat of every tree of the garden okay now so now okay this serpent okay was an actual man okay all right now he was created all right to be an adversary to 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 uh uh um yahweh okay now i'm gonna look up serpent serpent snake you know image of a serpent you know which is coming in the spirit of, of of a serpent, which is like which which it says that was okay. Let me get it real quick. More subtle, okay, subtle, shrewd, crafty, sly, sensible, sen sensible, crafty, shrewd, sensible, prudent. You know, so this individual, okay. That was in in the Garden of Eden was a, 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 a sly individual. Okay, all right. He was crafty. Okay, which he basically uh, um, beguiled Eve. You know, when you get into the story about this though. Okay, now this was an actual man. Okay, now you can read the, the um, this for yourself when you get into it though. Okay, but when you go down here, okay. He but he beguiled Eve, all right, to uh, um, eat of the fruit of the tree, which which was uh, uh, um um knowledge, okay, all right. Now, let's go to thirteen. And Yahweh power said unto the woman, "What is this thing that how thou hast done?" And the woman said, "The serpent beguiled me, and I did eat." You know, because he the serpent told them that you should not surely die, because um um Adam and Eve were given a commandment not to eat of the fruit of the tree okay all right and the serpent beguiled her into doing it right verse 14 and Yahweh power said unto the serpent because thou hast done this thou art cursed above all cattle and above every beast of the field upon thy belly shalt thou go and thus shalt thou eat all the days of thy life and I will put enmity between thee and the woman Okay, now who's that woman? Um, let's get a precept real quick. Okay, all right, we're gonna jump into um, Jeremiah six and two. I have likened the daughter of Zion to a comely and de delicate woman. Okay, all right, that's the point right there that I want to get. You know, so now when you go read reading on about it, okay. The woman is talking about Israel. Okay? Right? Let me read it again. And I will put enmity between thee and the woman, and between thy seed and her seed. And it shall bruise thy head, and thou shalt bruise his heel. You know? And when it goes into it, though, it's talking about the seed. Okay? So, this is the enmity of, 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 of generational enmity. Okay? Which is supposed to be, right? You know, offspring, descendants, posterity, children. Okay, so now this is a continual enmity. Okay, between her seed and thy seed. You know what I'm saying? Okay, which is talking to the serpent, which was the spirit of a serpent that was actual man. Okay, all right. So now. Okay, let me get real quick. All right, now this is actually really the, the, the man of sin. Okay, all right, you know, so from there, I want to get real quick. Well, you said that you're going to be uh, 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 cursed above all cattle, 
okay? Let's get uh, Job chapter 30 of chapter, okay? All right? All right? And this is basically going into uh, 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 um, Esau right here, okay? When you read the 30th chapter, though, you know? But there's uh, uh, think something I want to grab here, you know? All right? They were children of fools, yay, children of base men. They were viler than the earth, man, you know? And they are children of fools, okay? All right? The descendants of that serpent, okay? All right? All right? All right, and they're children of based men. Okay, all right, because you're gonna out on the belly that shall go. That means that you'll be a base man in the earth. Okay, all right, you know. So from there, I want to get. Genesis, the fourth chapter. Okay, all right. Right now, there's a thing called reincarnation, okay? All right, in the earth, all right, all right. But before I want to get this chapter though, I want to go back into uh, uh, um, um, the book of Revelation. Okay, let's get chapter 20, verse 2, and laid hold on the dragon, that old serpent, which is the devil and Satan, and bound him a thousand years. Okay, the point is, though, is that that dragon and that old serpent, which is the devil and Satan, goes back to the garden of Eden. Okay, all right. That's what that's talking about. Okay? That's where it goes back to. Okay? But I'm going to jump to Genesis, the fourth chapter. Okay? All right? Now we're going to talk about, we're going to go into Adam and Eve now. Now, Adam and Eve and his wife, and they, they conceived and bare Cain. You know? And I have said, I have gotten me a man from Yahweh. You know? Now, this is going into the, to, to the story of um, 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 where she bare Cain, and then she, she bare again, verse 2. And she bear again, again bear his brother Abel, and Abel was the keeper of the sheep, but Cain was a tiller of the ground. Okay, now this story. Okay, all right. Since you want to quote uh, uh, um, Genesis the twenty fifth chapter, you have to revert back to Genesis the fourth chapter. Okay, all right, because Jacob and Esau uh, were reincarnated from from uh, uh, um, uh, Cain and Abel. Okay. All right. They still had the same attributes, though. You know what I'm saying? You know, because Abel was a keeper of the sheep, you know, which he really kept at home and dwelt in the tents, which was uh, uh, Jacob, which what Jacob had actually done. OK. All right. But Cain was a tiller of the ground. So Esau was was actually, uh, you know, uh, a man of the field. OK. So they still had the same spirit on them. OK. All right. Right. And in the process of time, it came to pass that Cain brought the fruit of the ground and offering unto, unto Yahweh. But Abel, he also brought up the first things of his flock and of the fat thereof. And Yahweh had respect unto Abel and, and his offering. But unto Cain and to his offering, he had not respect. But Cain was very wroth and his countenance fell. And Yahweh said unto Cain, why art thou wroth? And why is thy countenance falling? Right? If thou does well, thou shalt not be accepted. And if thou does not well, sin lieth at the door. And unto thee shall be his desire, and thou shalt rule over him. Okay? Alright? So, yeah, how is talking to um, Cain and saying that if you don't do well, that sin lies at the door. You know? You know? And this is the great mystery where, where people can't can't understand. Okay? All right. All right. Verse 8. And Cain talked with Abel, his brother, and it came to pass when they were in the field, Cain rose up against Abel, his brother, and slew him. Okay? All right. Right? And Yahweh said unto Cain, Where is Abel thy brother? 
And he said, I know not. Am I my brother's keeper? Okay. All right. All right. So now it was already enmity between them. Okay. Which goes back back to that serpent though. But he's saying, but he got, got kind of wise, smart with, 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 with Yahweh saying, am I my brother's keeper? Okay. Right. And he said, what hast thou done? The voice of thy brother's blood cried unto me from the ground. You know? Right? So real quick, let me jump to Hebrews. Okay. Pull it up real quick. Chapter 9. Verse 22. All right. And almost all things are by the law purged with blood, and without shedding of blood is no, is no remission. Okay, so there's no remission of sin without the purging of blood. Okay, which would be a required of, of of Cain. Okay, so there's no remission of sins, man. You know, for him anyway. Okay, but. Getting back into the story, okay. He said that his brother's um, blood cried unto me to the ground. He says, Now that are our curse from the earth, okay, which have opened her mouth to receive thy brother's blood from thy hand, okay. All right, so that's the reason why I grabbed that that script real, um, from um, of Hebrews. Okay, all right. When thou tillest the ground, it shall not henceforth yield unto thee her strength. A fugitive and a vagabond shall thou be in the earth, man. And that's what basically the descendant of Esau. Okay, which goes back to Cain. Okay, this is this is a future prophecy that he was going to be a fugitive and a vagabond. Okay, is not Esau a fugitive and a vagabond in the earth? today okay all right a fugitive being being somebody that's fleeing from judgment okay and that vagabond just being going out in the earth you know and 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 and, and uh, uh uh dwelling in other people's places and moving the bounds of the people okay right and king said unto unto yahweh my punishment is greater than i can bear right behold thou has driven me out this day from the face of the earth and, the, and from thy face shall I be hid, you know, and his face is hid from Yahweh, okay, all right, because he's been rejected already, all right, he was rejected from the beginning, okay, right, and I shall be a fugitive and a vagabond in the earth, and it came to pass that everyone that findeth me shall slay me, okay, right, so from there, let's jump to back to Job, all right, all right, um, 30 and, and, uh, three, right? For want and famine, they were solitary, fleeing into the wilderness in former time, desolate and waste, who cut up marrows by the bushes and juniper roots for their meat. They were driven forth, they were driven forth from among men. They cried after them as a thief. To dwell in the clefts of the valleys and in the caves of the earth and in the rocks. Okay? Alright? So this is talking about uh, um, the descendants of Esau. Okay? Alright? Okay? Which goes back to Cain. You see? Right? From there, I want to jump to... Let's get... Um, John 8... Right? And 43. Right? All right. This is Yahweh Shai speaking, okay? Why do you not understand my speech? Even because I, even because ye cannot hear my word. Ye are of your father the devil, and the lust of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning, and abode not in the truth, because there was no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, 
for he is a liar and the father of it. Okay, so going back to where he was a murderer from the beginning. Okay, all right, that's going back to Cain. Okay, but we're talking about now. This is fast forwarding into the to the New Testament. Okay, all right. Now, jumping back. Okay. To Genesis four. Okay. Right. Right. And he said he was saying that, behold, thou hast driven me out from this day, from the face of the earth, and from thy face shall I be hid. Okay. And I shall be a fugitive and a vagabond in the earth, and it shall come to pass that everyone that findeth me slave me. So that's why I went to jump to Job. Right? Okay? And Yahweh said unto him, Therefore, whosoever slayeth Cain, vengeance shall be taken on him sevenfold. And Yahweh set a mark upon Cain, lest any finding him shall kill him. Okay? So Yahweh put a mark upon him, lest anybody should find him and shall kill him. So now we're going into that mark. Okay? Okay? Mark. A signal. Sign. A distinguishing mark. A banner. A uh, remembrance. Um, uh, ma 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 uh, uh, miraculous sign. An omen. Warning. A token. An ensign. A standard. Miracle. Proof. Okay? Alright? And that mark was leprosy. Okay? Alright? Because now... When you go back, it says, right? And whosoever, and Yahweh said unto him, therefore whosoever slayeth Cain, vengeance shall be taken on him sevenfold. So Yahweh put a hedge over Cain and basically his descendants, man, because he was to carry out his will on the left hand side, man. All right. Cain is the murderer or was a murderer from the beginning. Okay. All right. So now anybody that would take vengeance upon him shall be um, um that would that would slave Cain shall be taking vengeance sevenfold. All right. And Yahweh set a mark upon him. Right. His point, lest any finding him shall kill him. So he had to distinguish Cain from everybody else. OK. All right. So Cain originally had pigmentation. OK. So that distinguishing mark is 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 leprosy because now it's like you cannot just if 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 he was of 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 uh, a melanin flesh you know then anybody that would kill him you you cannot distinguish um who what or, or, or was Cain or descendants of Cain okay you know right and Cain went out from the presence of Yahweh and dwelt in the land of Nod east of Eden okay so he went out from the face of, of Yahweh so this is the descendant. Okay, all right. This, this, though, the Esau goes, the spirit of Esau goes back further than Genesis 25. Okay, all right. That spirit was in Cain. Okay, which goes back to the, to the Garden of Eden. You see, you know, all right. Let me get, um, first John. Make it our, uh, let's see, three and seven. Um, let's see. All right, verse eight. He that committed sin is of the devil, and for the devil sinneth from the beginning. For this purpose, for this purpose purpose for the son of, uh, uh, the son of, of, of Yahweh, Yahweh by Shem Shai was manifest that he might destroy the works of the devil okay because this was a purpose to be done in the earth man you know whosoever is born of, of Yahweh by Shem Shai do not commit sin for his seed remaineth in him okay and he cannot sin because he was born of Yahweh alright and this the children of Yahweh by Shem Shai, a manifest and the children of the devil. Okay. All right. All right. So now you're going to have that seed. All right. That enmity. Okay. That line. Okay. You said children of the devil. So who's the children of the devil? Okay. Because the, the spiritual demon Satan has a, a physical counterpart. Okay. All right. 
Whosoever doeth not righteousness is not of Yahweh, neither he that loveth not his brother, man. All right. And did not Cain uh, slew Abel? Okay. Right. For this is the message that ye heard from the beginning, that we should love one another. Right. Verse 12. Right. Not as Cain, who was that wicked one. Okay. And slew his brother and therefore slew he him because his works were evil and his brothers was righteous, man. Okay. All right. So now here it is. When the, and we're in the New Testament talking about going back to Cain. Okay. All right. Which predates the uh, uh, Esau coming into earth though. But uh, he, uh, uh, Esau is a descendant from Cain. Okay. All right. So with that, you know, all right. That wicked one, right? Okay. So now we're going to go to Chapter, uh, Job chapter 9 verse 24 The earth is given into the hand of the wicked Okay He covereth the faces of the judges thereof If not where and who is he Okay So now If you're saying that Esau is not the devil Okay Alright Which we went to Cain Alright Which went back to the serpent In, 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 uh, uh, um, in, um, uh, in the garden Okay If he's not the devil Then where and who is he You know you know, all right, from there, okay, I want to jump to, um, Second Thessalonians, the second chapter, okay, all right, let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a fall away first, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition, okay, all right, All right, the man of sin, right, to wander from the law of Yahweh, violate Yahweh's laws, the sin. All right, that which is done wrong, right, sin, an offense, a violation of the divine law, and brought or thought or or an act. You know, you know, right. Collectively, the com the complex or uh, aggregate of sins committed there. There by a single person or by many, man, and that goes back to that line, man. You know what I'm saying? Because really, when he went for that that offering, okay, all right, he didn't go according to the law, man. All right, he was supposed to be an animal sacrifice, man, not to be the first fruits from from the field. You know? Okay. You see? Now, from there, okay. going to go to let's see all right Amos chapter 1 verse 11 for thus say Yahweh for three transgressions of Edom and for four I will not turn away the punishment thereof because he did pursue his brother with the sword and did cast off all pity and his anger did tear perpetually and he kept his wrath forever. You see, you know, and that's the same spirit that Esau has as that Cain has. OK. All right. So now when you go to Genesis, let's see, the 27th chapter. All right. All right, get it down here. And Esau hated Jacob. This is verse, this is just Genesis 21, uh, 27, 41. And Esau hated Jacob because of the blessing wherewith his father had blessed him. And Esau said in his heart, the days of mourning for my father are at hand. Then will I slay my brother Jacob. Okay, you know? And then now, Okay, this is, is, a, is a perpetual hatred. Okay, 
all right it doesn't just stop at just esau and jacob it just goes it goes from in in to jacob um esau and his descendants you see you know so from there okay we're going to get malachi chapter one all right verse four the burden of the word of, the, of Yahweh to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, saith Yahweh. Yet ye say, wherein has thou how loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, saith Yahweh? Yet I loved Jacob, and I hated Esau, and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Okay? All right? Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build in desolate places. Thus say Yahweh of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down. And they shall call them the border of wickedness and the people whom whom Yahweh have in the nation for forever. Okay? Alright? So basically, when Cain went out from the face of of of, of Yahweh, okay, alright? That's when he said that he would turn in and build in desolate places, though. You know what I'm saying? Because he had went out from the site, you know, of of of, of Yahweh by Shimia Shai. Okay? You know? So this man is still standing today, but it the Esau, which is uh, uh, um, the uh, um, the descendants of of the of the physical uh, 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 it, it, which is the spiritual this physical counterpart of, of of the devil, okay, is still here in the earth. But when you go back to Cain, Cain it has that had that same spirit, okay. It was it's a line of, of the seed, okay, that goes back and predates Esau. Okay, which goes back to Cain, which goes back to the serpent in, in, the, in the garden, you know, so that's just the first half of this lesson right here where I was wanted to add to this question. But, you know, all right, concerning that, that, that first part of he asked, you know, why do we teach that Esau is a devil? Here it is, man. He accepts that he's 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 from the tribe of Judah. Okay, but he you, you can't see that that Esau is not the devil. Okay, all right, you know. The scriptures say the earth was given to the hands of the wicked, man. You know, I said, but saying if not, where and who is he? You know, all right. So with that, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Double honor to our apostles and elders, a great millstone, and peace and blessing to the Ark and is doing his work in sincerity and truth. And I'm gonna make put up another lesson uh, concerning the second part of this question. All right. So uh, uh, just stay tuned. Shalom.